Hi everybody, um, today I have another Topic Tuesday video for you. Today's topic is polish backups. So I do not have a ton of backups, but I do have a few, so I'm going to talk about them. I will do swatch pictures of everything so that you can see why I think these polishes are so amazing and a backup is required. So the first polish I ever decided that I needed a backup of was um, Sally Hansen Pacific Blue Original Formula. Um, what is funny about this polish is I bought it before I was ever into polish. I just went to the store, saw the color, thought it was cute, and got myself a bottle. And then when I got into polish, I actually realized like what a big deal it was to everybody that loves nail polish. And um, so I shook these up, but um, I've used probably about that much on this bottle. And then when Sally Hansen, um, here's both my bottles. So when Sally Hansen announced that they were going to um, discontinue this polish, everybody in the nail polish world was like, Sally Hansen, what are you thinking? Because this color is amazing, it's super unique, um, it's a great formula, you can get it opaque in usually one coat, and it's just like the most gorgeous, blue color on um, this color pops off the nail I love it for manicures I love it for pedicures I wasn't intending to get a backup when they announced that they were discontinuing because I thought well I already have so much polish like what are the chances I'm gonna use this whole thing up anyway then it was probably like a year after it had been discontinued I went to a random Walmart um I don't even remember where we were and um they had a bottle and i was like oh my gosh this is the original pacific blue and i was just like okay this is a sign from god that you need this polish so i bought my backup and um i have no regrets of having a backup because this polish is gorgeous you guys i honestly have no idea what sally hansen was thinking reformulating it the new pacific blue color is not as pretty as this it's darker um, the formula is not as good and um, at the time they announced it a few youtubers actually had like rant videos where they just like were what the heck Sally Hansen um, young wild and polish has one and every time I watch it it just cracks me up because I just remember like how upset everybody was like why would you do this you know and so um, I'm glad I have my backup um, I'm sorry for you guys that do not have the original Pacific Blue. Um, it is a gorgeous, gorgeous polish. I actually wish I would have thought ahead and picked up more backups, just maybe for like giveaways and stuff, but I don't know. I just, I don't know. I don't know what I was thinking at that time, but when this one showed up like mysteriously at this Walmart, I was just like, okay, give it to me. And um, gorgeous polish. So the next one that I decided I needed a backup of is China Glaze Purple Panic. This is probably my favorite neon pink in all of my collection. This color um, polish is a super bright pink. It has a little bit of a purple shimmer. You can kind of see it there in the bottle. Um, Oh my gosh, you guys, I love this polish. Love, 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 love. Um, so I don't have a full size backup. I have a mini size backup of this. Um, like two summers ago in Sally's, they had these little bits. It's not a total mini, it's a little bit bigger, but they had um, this size on clearance for, I wanna say like a dollar. So I knew that I loved this so much, so I ended up picking up this one. I love to wear this in the summer. Um, I love it as a pedicure. I love it as a manicure. Um, the shimmer just gives it this glow. It pops off the nails. Um, the formula is not the greatest, but it is kind of a neon. But um, I don't even care because you guys just look at that color. I mean, oh, it's amazing. So I'm glad to have my little mini backup of it. Um, I wear this every summer at least once, at least as one manicure and at least as one pedicure, just because it is totally and completely amazing. And the last polish that I have a backup is called Revlon Hypnotic. And um, 
this polish is like a glowy um glowy purple kind of magenta color look at that you guys oh my gosh so um this polish my bff janet bought for me for christmas i think christmas or my birthday i don't know she always buys me a little something for christmas or my birthday and it's usually polished so that's very sweet of her and um she picked this out for me and as soon as i got it on the nails i was like oh my gosh omg um it's just gorgeous i mean look at that it's just so glowy and it just like pops off the nail oh my goodness this polish is gorgeous the formula is not the greatest again but um when the polish looks like that like who cares you know um there's some formulas or some polishes that i don't care what the formula is like like i will put up with the most horrific formula for a gorgeous color and i mean the formula is not horrific on this it's just not it's not two coats it's like three coats but gosh look at that oh my goodness so those are all the backups that i have in my collection i am interested to see um everybody else's what backups they have and just if you guys don't have instagram or um youtube if you could just comment down below what backups you have i am dying to know because i know some people have tons of backups i know some people don't believe in backups so i just want to see what everybody's thoughts are on the subject i love these topic tuesday videos just because i feel like we learn so much about each other and like what our polish habits are so um i'm dying to know and i'll list the names of all the polishes i talked about today down below in case anybody's interested and um, if you liked my video, please make sure to click the like button down below. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please do. Thank you so much for taking time out of your day to watch. And I will see you all on the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.